this is hard for people to talk about. This is something Alexis wanted to talk about. We are going to be talking today about mental health and, and the way that it has affected our relationship. Yep. Is that blurry now? Yeah, that's not. Is that not blurry? No. Are we sure? I think so. Because the last video we filmed, it was like blurry, bad. I don't know. <clears throat> Looks pretty good to me. Yeah, it looks okay. What's up, LNA squad? Welcome back to our channel. Luke and Alexis, and today, <sighs> we are going to be covering a school bus that just went by. Isn't it summertime? Yeah. Are kids out of school? Yeah. Okay, anyway, we are going to be covering a topic that a lot of people, I feel like, struggle with. Yeah, this is hard for people to talk about. Um, this is something Alexa wanted to talk about. I'm just pointing that out. This is something she struggles with and she wanted to make this video. So I'm proud of you for speaking up. I feel like there's not enough, like people don't talk about it enough yeah. and it needs to be talked about and people like us who have an influence don't open up about the fact that we feel that way or that we have those feelings then how are people ever going to think that that's okay? It's so it is so hot in here. I don't know why, why did we decide to do this in, in the truck? Ask yourself that. We are going to be talking talking today about mental health and the and way that it has affected me yes. and our relationship. Yep. Mental health affects everyone differently. Yep. Um, it has played a toll on our relationship. Not like a bad, it's an obstacle we've had to overcome. Right. And our life isn't as perfect as, you know, it might seem on camera. Like we have things that happen, things that bother us. And we, we just, have arguments too. Like we just wanted to share this part of our relationship yeah. and of ourselves. Before we get any further into this, we would like to, in the future, drop a course talking about having a healthy relationship and keeping a healthy relationship with your significant other because a lot of people struggle with it we have a lot of different knowledge on that we've been together for a super long time yeah so i think we could bring a lot of really valuable knowledge to younger people who are looking to be in a healthy strong relationship for yep. a long period of time giving advice and stuff on you know how to overcome different obstacles and how to keep your faith and your love for your yeah. partner alive and this is the first time we've ever talked about this on any of our platforms you're hearing it right here we will be dropping a personalized course helping you guys and coaching you on how to keep a strong relationship all right now that's out of the way stay tuned for that we've got some big plans if you guys are new here though hit that subscribe button we usually don't do stuff like this but like we said it's important to sit down and talk yeah. once in a while you never know how many people are out there struggling with the same thing that i am Mental so health is, is serious yeah so specifically for me i deal mostly with um anxiety um dude her anxiety can i just give some examples real quick please sure i've got a smudge on these glasses it's bothering the heck out of me her anxiety is so bad like the littlest things set it off and i've had to learn how to cope and how to help be able to help her through that right my anxiety started getting like really bad probably about a year and a half ago yeah and we don't really know why like it just kind of started getting really bad and then all of a sudden i had to be on meds for it because it, it got to the point where it was, it was uh debilitating like i couldn't live my life and be happy and be and happy because i was having so much anxiety and it was it was really bad for a while until i started getting on meds i was like crying every day having anxiety attacks every day and it's like stuff that she didn't have to worry about either that's yeah. the thing the stuff that she's worrying about is stuff that we don't have to worry about like we're fine you know like we're good yeah but she still is worried so that's a big thing for me also is um like being in large crowds or meeting new people stuff like that has always given me a lot of anxiety um but we love meeting you guys we've actually met a few of our subscribers and followers around like our hometown and also like when we travel we meet people so that is so cool we love meeting you guys don't think that that's the case no not um, at all i also have social anxiety like i i i don't have bad anxiety but i also do feel anxious sometimes around like big crowds and right just... which i feel like a lot of people feel that way yeah you know so we're here to tell you guys like it's normal to feel and it's okay to have those feelings but you gotta be able to talk about them yeah i got diagnosed with anxiety started taking meds about a year and a half ago and i've kind of been on and off my meds since then because i'm really bad at taking my pills so i think i'm on my fourth type of like medicine now and i just am starting back up because i didn't take it for two months which is yeah. tough because you know the anxiety tells you like things in your head i don't know how to explain it like yeah my anxiety tells me i need to take my medicine but then also my anxiety during the day distracts me from remembering to go get my medicine from the pharmacy so i took basically like a two-month break and now i'm starting back up again i have a solution to fix all your problems why don't we just go on a cruise once a month <laughs> and then that will I am keep happy you distracted when I'm on a cruise. It, right 
you're never unhappy when you're on a cruise. So how can you be unhappy? You're in the middle of an ocean and traveling to a beautiful place. How can you be unhappy? Yeah. So getting back into how uh, anxiety, depression, and stuff like that affect not only our relationship, but our personal life. And It's, yeah, it's tough because um, for someone, like, I have the anxiety, like, whatever. But for someone who doesn't, like, he at first was kind of just like, like, I don't understand what your problem is. Like, why don't you just calm down? And I think he has had to learn that that doesn't happen. That doesn't, like, you can't just work. calm down and honestly like he has grown with me so much and learned with me so much on how to help me and you know what to actually say that is beneficial that he is actually the when i'm having an anxiety attack yeah. i always if i'm not with him text or call him and he immediately talks me out of it and i like am forever I grateful you. for him because i don't know what i would do got you so yeah i just want to say like people struggle with anxiety and mental health more than you know, if you guys do struggle with it, the course that we are going to be dropping not only will help you with the relationship, but also help you find ways. It's going to be personalized from her, someone who has struggled with it, gone through the wor her worst days, fought through it, and is still here to tell you her story. <laughs> um, so the course is going to be built around that. But not only that, but also how to keep a strong relationship. Yeah, and, um, but we want to be able to share the beautiful knowledge that we have, the beautiful thing that we've created between each other, which is just unconditional love and mm -hmm. support for each other. We want to be able to teach you guys how to do that. Whether you're in a relationship now or you aren't in a relationship and you're going to be looking for one, it's all great knowledge to have because you got to know how to cope with each other and work right. together right. this isn't our typical video um but if you're watching it right now thank you for being here and thank yes. you for thank watching you guys so much for your support honestly like your guys' support helps a lot too thank yep. you guys and um i think we'll catch you in the next one yeah, we'll catch you in the next one peace peace